Okay, what's up, YouTube? This is Gamerman432 with another gaming blog and a little bit of gaming news. Alright, now, one thing I want to get out of the way, this is probably going to be the main reason people watch this video, or if anybody watches this video. A yet another or a new Call of Duty is going to be released this year. Really, should we really be surprised? I mean, I mean, they pretty much started releasing Call of Duty, so like most every year, I think since like Call of Duty Four, whatever. I could be wrong, but well, whatever. This Call of Duty is going to be called Call of Duty Black Ops and Black Ops, and like all the other Call of Duties, it will be released in November. Now, earlier I actually went on GameStop. Game, now, how I found out about the new Call of Duty, I was going on GameStop to see some reviews of Street, Super Street Fighter 4, and and all, and up on the front page goes Call of Duty Ops. I'm like, oh sweet, a new Call of Duty. That's not surprising. Now, one thing that I'm really now one thing I'm wondering about Call of Duty though is that are they gonna like are they gonna use the Modern Warfare 2 engine to engine? Are they gonna use the Call of Duty 4 engine, or are they just gonna make a new engine on their own? Doesn't really matter. Call of Duty will be called in anyways. I mean, you'll have, you'll have a good, you'll have a good, decent campaign. You'll have, you'll have, you'll have fun on multiplayer. And and apparently, I apparently according to this website I'm looking at right now, apparently the they're gonna have like a trailer that's gonna be released on game trailers at 12:40 a.m. Which on Easter time, which I'm not probably not even gonna be up for that. Because I'm gonna be camping. Usually when I'm camping, I go to bed wicked early. Though, though I try to go to bed early, but then I end up waking up at, a, at almost noon time the next morning. <laughs> ah. Anyways, then also, Avatar, the movie. Now I'm gonna. Now if I can find a link to this, I will. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention. Back to Call of Duty Black Ops real quick. If you go to GameStop's website. I seen a picture of the PlayStation 3, and apparently they made a mistake. On the PlayStation 3 box office, it says only on PlayStation, but if you go look on GameStop, it clearly shows that there's going to be a PC version and a 360 version. So I don't know why the hell they do that, and not only and not to mention how stupid it would be if they just only released on PlayStation 3. I mean, Call of Duty's on PlayStation 3s, so they sell pretty well, but don't you, but they probably make even but they probably make more money if they release it on the PC and 360. So, I don't know how the hell they can make that mistake on the PlayStation 3's box art, but whatever. Anyways, back to Avatar. Now, now I'm not gonna, now I was gonna point the link to, uh, post a link to this, to the Avatar problem, but I'm not going to. See, apparently with the new Avatar movie released on Blu-ray DVD, apparently there's like a problem with it about people trying to view it. And I don't know too much about it, so I'm not gonna even talk about it. So, if you want to know yourself, go look it up. I guess I found it out on, the, on like Yahoo or something. So maybe it might be still on Yahoo's homepage. No, let me go to Yahoo real quick. Let's see if they still have it. If they do, I'll link it. And now they don't still have it. And no, it's not on Yahoo's page. So look it up, I guess. And then, yeah, so, alright, now, what the hell else can I talk about? Well, I'll talk about Chrono Trigger for a little bit. Now, Chrono Trigger, I'm just playing that game right now. I'm not really getting that many views, although, although, Part 3 is getting 21 views. But that's only because it probably has the freaking title Sonic Link 1269 69 on it, which... Maybe I'll try to put it in all. Maybe I'll put Sonic Link's name on my videos to see if that happens. I don't know, just to test it out a little bit. But and then part one we got three views, which that's which I didn't really do anything in part one. All I did was went and collected money and all that crap. So if you want to know how to get some good money in the game, go in the beginning of the game. Go watch. <coughs> Sorry, go watch part one. But other than that, I'd recommend just skipping the part two. But yeah, as for Chrono Trigger, I've got like wicked farther than my let than, than my Let's Play video shown. Like, see, I'm playing this game on my laptop and my desktop, and on my desktop, I, I 
I'm like going way farther and I'm only playing it on my laptop to do, to do the let's play because if I do the let's plays videos on my laptop it's much easier so I have to put the file on my desktop and let it upload overnight but whatever I'm used to it although that might be a problem now you see recently I lost my PSP which that fucking blows I, I was looking everywhere I couldn't find it got pissed off but the thing is, I was actually using my PSP's me memory card to actually transfer all the Chrono Trigger episodes from my laptop to my desktop so I can upload them from my desktop. And if I try to upload them on my laptop, my laptop will eventually fall asleep and then the upload will can will just cancel by itself or whatever. And... Yeah, so that's pretty much... So for the very few people that have watched my Chrono Trigger Let's Play, Let's Play episodes, that's why I haven't uploaded any episodes recently, because I lost my PSP, and I used my PSP memory card to transfer any, to transfer datos, m data, no, not data, vi videos, Let's Play episodes from my laptop to my, my desktop, so I can upload them to my desktop, because my desktop is faster in terms of internet, so... Yeah, so until so unless I find unless I find my PSP or some other thing to to transfer my files to my desktop with, there will pro there probably won't be any let's play episodes for a while. So yeah, and as I'm looking at my channel comments right now, some dude says and says I'm popular, which I don't even get why, because at the time he said that, that was one year ago, I only had like freaking 10 subscribers. But whatever. Anyways. Let's see, is there anything, damn, is there anything else I could talk about? There's like, really nothing much going on. I mean, I could keep up to date with gaming news, but I don't usually like to do that. I just want to play, I just want the games to come out and just play them. Well, there was one person I'd like to mention on YouTube. I'm not gonna say any names, but this freaking dude comes on here, right? Now, this guy's pretty racist, and the thing is, he doesn't even realize it, I don't think. Like, he's pretty much trying to say, oh, but nigger and spick and crackers have, like, definitions and all that, but, but if I go up, but let's just say my friend is ignorant, because I think nigger, the N-word also means ignorant, so I'm not I'm not too sure but if I go up to my friend and I go oh dude you are such a nigga do you really think somebody's gonna freaking think of it like oh it's oh he doesn't oh it's a different definition no oh, no one's gonna think of that they're gonna be like what the fuck is that guy racist or some shit I mean some I get, I don't know too much about this argument which is why I'm not mentioning any names but some people but some guy comes on here he's pretty much being like oh racist Racist of crap, and he's pretty much like, oh, uh, you shouldn't, oh, uh, you shouldn't be crying. Freaking racism, and he's like, and I think he like joked about racism in a little bit. What his family did? For one, his family's racist. That's all I'm gonna say. And for two, racism, it's really nothing to joke about. I don't give a shit where it's from, whether it's on the internet or YouTube. And you know what? Hell, it's even one, this one time I was on Xbox Live, and these freaking dumbasses like making a joke of how. It was like these freaking. Okay, if you don't like racism jokes, turn this video off right now, cause you, cause you're probably, cause the story I'm about to tell, you're probably just gonna want to take your fist and just freaking punch your computer through the goddamn punch your computer screen, cause I'm pretty sure my story I'm about to tell right now is gonna make someone do that. All right, I only have one minute, so I'll make this as quick as possible. Okay, there's this one freaking. Okay, there's these two people on Xbox Live, and there's this one black person. Sorry, sorry if I sound racist, but that's the only way I can describe this person. So these two white people, they're pretty much in an argument with a black person. Now the black person, he had enough of the shit, so he left, which, you know, if anyone's giving me any sh shit on Xbox Live, I do the same thing. And then these freaking white people, they're pretty much making racism jokes about black people, and I'm going to, and I'm going to assume that they were racist. And they pretty, and they pretty much talking about a bus and how there's like and then there's some, and there's like freaking and they pretty much made a joke about how some about about how someone would like shoot all the 
kids on the bus or whatever, which that's nothing to joke about. But then one guy goes, "Oh, what about? Oh, what if there was all black people on that bus?" Really bad joke. And and for those of the people who were on that who were on Xbox Live on that day on Grand Theft Auto 4, you know who you are. Though I highly doubt you'll watch this video. What the fuck? What the fuck? That's all I gotta say. I mean, seriously, racism, in my opinion, way too much of a problem. But that's it. That's all I have to say. Whether you like this video or not, I don't know. I don't care. So, yeah, new Call of Duty coming out in November. Avatar's having problems. Me rambling on about some freaking goddamn match I had, I had on Xbox Live about racism and all that shit, though. Though I don't really know much about about what was happening. I mean, maybe the black person said something to make those freaking people go all race, racist and shit. I don't know, but whatever. But whatever. This is Gaming Man 432. Have a good weekend. I'll see you guys later at some point.